So you started just a few of your seeds indoors early, but why? Well, because it's still not warm enough outdoors and some varieties really do call for an early start. But seedlings grown indoors can grow thin, pale and lean towards the light because they need more light than they're getting. Right, so of course artificial light can help, but don't ignore the other growing conditions like temperature, humidity, air movement and fertilizer in making a great seedling. Now don't get me wrong, seeds actually need heat and moisture to get started, but once they've germinated, you'll stop using things like this seedling heating mat or those humidity domes that trap in the humidity. Excess heat and humidity can lead to lush, floppy growth in your new seedlings. Using a fan for gentle air movement will help to distribute that humidity, but also strengthen up the stems of your seedlings. Once they're past the stage of seed leaves, they're going to develop true leaves that look like the adult plants in the garden. Feed them at about half the recommended strength, either with organic or conventional fertilizer.